Yeah. What a testimony. The question is, who do you have faith in? Who do you call on when you are in the midst of the tribulation of this war? When the storm comes from the left, right, front and back, and you are the center of it, he said unto the storm, let it be still, and the storm was, was as still. So who are you calling on to? That is what our brother is telling us. I pray that God will help us in Jesus. You know, you have said it all. In the book of Hebrews chapter 13, verse 8, it said, Jesus is the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. That is the testimony. That is, he has done it then. He's still doing it. He's going to do it today. And he will still do it tomorrow. He never stops his work. Do you still have any other testifier in the house? Yes. You're welcome, quickly. I will take you out to her, please. This testimony, I think I'll need everybody to stand up because 50 years is not 50 years old. Yeah. Please stand up. You. you are going to all help me say 50 glorious hallelujah. 50. Are we ready? Yes. Are we ready? Yes. Who is going to be counting? Because we can't count. Here we go. Some of us were wondering that hallelujah is not up to 50. 
God does not need it to be up to 100. What he just did is one that you say sincerely with your heart and you believe that it is for him. I don't know, but I just want us to be in spirit with everything that happens here today. As she was saying it, and the spirit just ministered to me, maybe that's what God wants to take from somebody today. Maybe that's your message that you are going to usher in with this program. We all know what hallelujah does. It breaks every barrier. What did Elijah, um, what's his name? I forgot his name now. It's just good. Elijah did with the wall of Jericho. He surrendered it and they were singing praises and they were shouting the name of God. And the wall of Jericho fell. Joshua, thank you, sir. So it's very strong and I want us to take everything serious. You're welcome, my place. We have another person, please let's be on standby. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I was sitting there and I was saying, should I give this testimony or not? But I want to give the testimony to encourage somebody tonight. Uh, for the past couple of weeks, I have had some headaches. I have been really weak. And then I kept saying, oh my God. I'm, every day I think the headache is going to go. Every day I keep thinking it's going to go. I've been praying. So something happened yesterday. And I want to give God the glory. And uh, when daddy came last time, remember the water that we prayed for and the anointing oil. I have it in the office. I still have my water. Then as I was looking, I said, hey, that water is still there. So I prayed and I took the water and I drank. I said, everything that is in my system that is causing this headache, go away in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I took the anointing oil. I anoint the crown of my head and the sole of my feet. I say, Satan, wherever you're coming from, I cast you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen? As I prayed that prayer, I started having the pressure going down. For the past three weeks, I have had this headache. Today, it is gone. So whatever is happening here is not a joke. When daddy says, bring your water and bring your anointing oil, you have faith. Hallelujah. God has touched me. And I pray that you will not go back the way you came in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You won't leave here like you came in Jesus' name. Bound, oppressed, tormented, full of fear. Cause the Holy Ghost to set you free you won't live here like you can in Jesus name Amen mm, Jesus the miracle worker Hallelujah Do we have another testifier in the house please? In the absence of none I would like to beg us in the name of Jesus to please let's rise on our feet as the choir will come. We are going back to that hallelujah. And they are going to sing the hallelujah song to us because they can do it better than we. I can. And then from there we'll go to the next section. Please, we want the hallelujah because it's the hallelujah that can do it and it's going to do it. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Oh. Hallelujah. Hey. It's a song of victory. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Oh. Let the sound of rejoicing fill this place. Sing hallelujah. Hallelujah, song of victory, song of victory, sing hallelujah. 
of today to your holy hands. We give it unto you as a token of appreciation. We ask that you accept it to your glory in Jesus' name. Oh Lord, this is just a minor from that which you will testify about. Oh Lord, in your abundance, overcome and release unto us your goodness today in Jesus' name. Even throughout the course of this program, oh God, let our man be full of thanks and gratitude in Jesus' name. For in Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Hallelujah. 
Amen. Amen. Please, I want us to be connected. If people are clapping seriously and fighting the battle with those songs, I believe no one should just be looking around. It's very dangerous. We shall not go back home with another battle. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Even if we sing it in your bar, don't worry. Just be connected. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, oh Lord. Oh, hey.
Lord. The every load of darkness. In my body. study the word of God in this session we want to pray and the title of this section of this prayer section is oh God set me free say oh God set me free say oh God set me free can you shout it louder than that can you shout it to somebody beside you Bible says in the book of 1st John chapter 3 verse 8, you can open it with me. The Bible says there, 1st John chapter 3 verse 8, it says, He that committed sin is of the devil, for the devil sinned from the beginning. For this purpose, the Son of God was manifested, that he might destroy the works of the devil. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As human beings, the devil is our greatest enemy. In fact, he's the only enemy we have. Hallelujah. Amen. He's the only enemy we have. Because he's always jealous of us. Because Jesus so loves us so much. The devil is jealous. And he wants to pollute the race of men with different kind of problems, diseases, sickness, infirmities, and many, many things that are going around our lives. They are the works of darkness. That's why the Bible is teaching us here that Jesus manifested for this singular reason, to destroy the works of darkness. And the works of darkness, number one, is sin. 
Sin is number one work of darkness that the devil can use to operate against our destiny. And that's why that verse says that he that committed sin is of the devil, and devil has sinned right from the beginning. Beloved, I'm praying for you that today you will not go on the same in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God will meet you at the point of your needs in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So get yourself ready, concentrate. As we are praying the other times, people are, are not connected yet. You can see the testimony of my brother there. He said that he was connected to the power of the program that he went to and he got home. He used that same power to heal someone that was about to die. It was not him that healed the person, but the power of God. Let's turn our Bibles again and I will read Luke. Let's open our Bibles. Are we here with our Bibles? If you are here with your Bible, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. People don't used to come with their Bibles when they are coming to the house of the Lord. They just want miracle to happen like that. Anything that will happen comes right from the word of God. Because God watches over his word. And he watches to perform it and make sure that his word that has been spoken from his mouth comes to existence and manifestation. We are looking at the book of Luke chapter 8. We are about to pray. I'm just laying the foundation of the prayer we want to pray. Luke chapter 8, I'll read from verse 43. And a woman having an issue of blood, 12 good years, which had spent all her living upon physicians, neither could he be healed of any. Hallelujah. This is the story of this woman. She has spent all she had on physician. There are so many people here today, they so much believe in doctor's report. They so much believe in the negative utterance from their enemies or the dictates of darkness against their lives. So people have zeroed their mind that they cannot even come out from, or from that problem. They are just in trouble. They don't even know where to go. But here's the story of a woman that has spent everything she had. She has visited every physician. You know, there's something particular about the doctors. When they make research, and when they make some uh, uh, samples, and they try to make some tests, they give you hope. Sometimes they tell you that this will end the disease. But many times, it's not, their researches are not able to deliver you. This is the case of this woman. The Bible says she has visited so many physicians. They don't have solution to your problem. Doctors don't have solution to your problem. Or do they have solution to their problem? Doctor dies too. <laughs> they fall sick too. They have different kind of problems too that they cannot heal by themselves. But Jesus is passing by today. I will not want you to pass you by. God will connect you where you are seated in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Your testimony, your miracle will connect with you where you are seated in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You see, there's no way you can run to okay, that to run to Jesus. This woman has done everything, but she noticed that Jesus was passing by and she used all available opportunity to connect to Jesus. Say, I shall connect to Jesus today. I shall connect to Jesus today. The claim of this revival is Jesus, the miracle worker. Are you going to be connected? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. So, God has answered my prayers. We are going to pray very, very well. <laughs> Shout hallelujah. hallelujah. This woman was like many of us. Seeking for solution where there was no solution. Running around, spending money. Something about the devil is this. He tries to take what you have out from you. behind whatever devil is the one behind it 
if you want to cooperate with the devil that's when you will say it's not behind any problem in your life then you are a, you are a friend to him but i will not be a friend to the devil in the name of jesus christ say your own the number one enemy we have is the devil and is the only enemy that we have the bible says jesus is highly lifted up above all powers above all names that at the mention of the name of jesus christ every knee should bow it is the knees of those problems you have and they must bow today in the name of jesus christ Amen. i don't want you to come here to just come and see the prophet jesus is the one passing by he's the one that will touch you he's the one that will use the prophet for us he's the one that will use the prophet for because god can use anything shout hallelujah in this in this in, in this in this part that i want to read jesus garment was the one that healed that woman but it was not ordinary garment it was the power in that garment that healed the woman it was the virtue that flowed out from from jesus christ that healed the woman i'll read further i'll read verse 44 before we start to pray came behind him the woman came behind jesus and touched the border of his garment and immediately a issue of blood seized immediately a issue of blood seized in fact when this woman was trying to touch the hem of the, the garment of jesus she was not distracted she was focusing on what she has come to receive many people will come to a place of prayer like this but they will not be focused they want to just look at how things will be happening but your your own life needs miracle say my life needs miracle say my life needs freedom and you shall get it in the mighty name of jesus christ so get yourself ready it's not everybody that were healed in the time of jesus christ it was not everybody that died that came back to life but those that received the mercy those that got in contact with the lord the bible says how jesus christ of nazareth was anointed with the holy ghost and with power and he was going about doing good healing those that were oppressed of the devil because god was with him shout hallelujah, hallelujah. so jesus himself was in the business of healing people but he was going about are you going to meet jesus today yes. or is jesus going to meet you today say amen to that jesus will meet you in the mighty name of jesus christ amen. it means that some people jesus did not meet them some people did not meet jesus but you will meet the Lord today in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That's why I'm telling you that it is not the prophet you have come to meet. You have made a mistake if you think that is the prophet. In fact, the prophet will tell you that he is not the one that is doing it. It is the work of the Lord and it's the power of God in him that will, that will do the miracle that we need. And you will not be exempted in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This woman was focused, highly focused on the master that will heal her. The disciples were around Jesus, but many of them, even those that are thronging around Jesus, were not healed. But this woman minded her business, and she she located the hem. You will not understand. It's not just the garment that she touched. She located a spot in the in 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 the in the garment, a particular spot. So she was actually watching and 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 fixing her eyes on a particular place. Not just touching anyhow. Other people were touching the garment anyhow, but she touched that garment with an expectation. She touched the garment in adoration and in reverence to the power of God. That's why she stood low to touch the garment. Are you going to humble yourself today to receive the power of God and to receive your miracle? I'm praying that God will open your eyes and we meet you at the point of your needs today in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We want to pray right now. We want to destroy the works of darkness hallelujah Amen. you have to be a prayer addict i know some people that are prayer addicts they are already they already are, 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 are excited but some people are already saying what prayer again let the prophet just come and just be declaring your miracle could even come now if you know what you are doing hallelujah some people have even received their miracle already in the time of the praise and worship in the time of the testimony testimony is enough for some people to receive their testimonies also if you if you are connected to what they are saying you are connected with the power of God that they are trying to exalt before the children of God. You are connected to it, then you definitely receive your deliverance. So many people have received the miracle already and it shall be permanent in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Right now, let's be on our feet. The time for battle. 
get yourself ready. If you know there is a challenge in your life, don't say, doctor has said this is how it should be. I don't want that kind of language. If you know that thing is not, it should not be part of your life, then you have the opportunity right now to declare war against it. Hallelujah. I was one time asthmatic. I think I've shared this many, many years ago, and my mommy had two. And doctor told me that it is inherited, you have to inherit it, it's, it's kind of... And I believe it. I believe it. And I was, I was living with it like that for years. But what, what struck me that made me to pray was that I talked to myself. Because I'll be doing very well in school, academically very, very well. When it, when, when it came to the time to write exam, I will have the attack. Then I began to, this should not be normal. This one is not normal. Then I sought it out in prayer. Shout hallelujah. hallelujah. I sought it out because I believed that this is not my portion. It was not my portion. I should live a healthy life God has given to me. Devil should not steal my joy and my health away. You have to realize that. If, if you are, before you pray, you must know exactly what you are looking for. This woman the, with the issue of the blood understood her predicament. She understood what exactly she had gone through. So if you are here, you don't even know why you are here. You just want to come and look. Or you, don't even, you just don't even understand the problem or where you are even going in life. It's a problem. You have to pray for that first. You need deliverance specially for that. If you don't know that by now, if you are, if you are, you are over, over 30 years, let me just say 28 years and you are not married, something is wrong. You should know that you should have married. Or you are here, you are looking for the fruit of the woman and it's not forthcoming. You should know that you must pray and you must have your testimony. Or you're supposed to have a good job. You just say no. You're just claiming that they used to do here. So I have to do it also. Then you don't even know who you are. You have to understand your destiny. God's destiny for your life before you can pray this prayer and you have results. This woman understood what she wanted and she had it. So get yourself ready. If you have one sickness or the other, is the time for the sickness to leave you now. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. They are all works of darkness. They are not the work of God. Jesus said, the Bible said Jesus was going about doing good. He was not doing evil, but the devil, the Bible said, he was looking for who to devour, who to destroy. So it is an opposite assignment. Two of them are crying about. We want to call on Jesus that does good. And he will visit you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Raise up your hands and begin to sing a song to the Lord. The song that you know you can sing. Sing it to the Lord in your dialect. You can sing it in Finnish language. You can sing it in your dialect. But make sure you are singing a song of worship, a song of praise to God. To appreciate the power of God. It's not a man that will do anything. It's God that will do it in your life. Appreciate him, appreciate him for what he's about to do. Because you have him as your God. Thank him because the Bible says God will never forsake his children. He will never forsake his children. Tell him thank you because he has never forsaken you. A lot of people don't have this opportunity to pray right now. They don't even have the opportunity to be here. Because the devil has got hold of them. The devil has destroyed their destiny already. He has used sickness to destroy their destiny. But why can't you lift up your hands and say, God, thank you for this opportunity you have given to me to be here. To thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him. Oh, yes. Give it back to him. Worship him. Worship the king of kings. Worship the lord of lords. The miracle worker. The god of signs and wonders. The omniscient god, omnipotent god. The god of love. The god of power. The god that can do all things. Nothing is impossible for the lord to do. The god that can break the yokes of darkness. The god that can break bondages of darkness. The god that can heal. The god that can deliver. The healer, the great physician, the almighty God, the God of love, the God of redemption. Worship him, worship him. Eternal King of glory, El Shaddai. The first and the last, the beginning and the ending. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Now, get yourself ready to pray. Thank you, Father. Say, every darkness around my life. Every darkness around my life. Light of the living God. Destroy, of the living God. Destroy, of the living God. Destroy, of the living God. 
restore it now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. Beloved, pray the prayer very well. This is the time and the moment for you to pray for yourself. Pray for yourself, pray for yourself, pray for yourself. Every darkness around you, let the light of Jesus. The Bible says the light of Jesus shineth, and darkness cannot comprehend it. Oh yes, you can do better, you can do better, you can do better. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh yes, somebody is set free, somebody is receiving his deliverance, somebody is receiving a deliverance. Shall the prayer very well, shall the prayer very well. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I told you that number one enemy is the devil, and devil works with sin against the lives of children, the children of God. When he, he, he uses sin against you, then darkness will take over. And the Bible says the wages of sin is what? Death. Someone that is dead cannot see anything because he works in darkness. Beloved, you are going to pray. Serious business right now. Thank you, Jesus. You will pray like this. Say every power of sin in my life every power of sin in my life I break you to pieces in the mighty name of Jesus you can break it to pieces by the power in the blood of Jesus every power of sin that sin the devil is using against your testimony that sin the devil is using against you as your weak point that sin the devil is using to torment your destiny. You have the power in Jesus Christ to destroy it now. Begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray. You can do better, beloved. You can do better, you can do better. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Raise up your right hands to the heavenly like this. Thank you, Father. Say, every walk of darkness in the heavenly Working against my divine assignments. Can you shout that prayer very well? Scatter now in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, put your mouth to pray. Oh, yes, you have the opportunity, beloved. Why can't you pray very well? Why can't you pray very well? Shout the prayer, shout the prayer, shout the prayer. As you are praying for yourself, beloved. You are praying for your children, you are praying for your husband. Thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. We are going to pray one of the prayers I prayed when I received my deliverance, when I was, I was uh, God freed me from the spirit and the power of asthma. And I, the prayer I will tell you, and I want you to pray it very well. I prayed that prayer that day, and I prayed so well. And that was the end. Of, I went home and I told my mommy, to, do you know that this thing is not part of you? Say, ah, I believe, you want me to pray for you? I said, you will receive your healing, no? Because this thing is not part of my life anymore. They say, I believe. And to the glory of God, till we are talking now, he's asthmatic free. Yeah. When I was sharing the testimony with my wife one day, maybe last three months, and I said, this is testimony, let me call my mother so that you will, you will, you will understand too. And I asked my mother, have you, do you, since then, do you have any experience? Said, no, have you forgotten? Since that day, nothing again. Did that, since that day, nothing. Praise the Lord. Amen. That is what God can do. I shared this testimony with a scientist. And he said, mm, all those things that, <laughs> that it's, it's, it's by chance, it's a coincidence. It's a coincidence that it doesn't, it's, there's no any God anywhere, no anything. It's a coincidence. <laughs> but me, that I was ill, <laughs> I know it wasn't a coincidence. Because I knew what I was going through then. It's like somebody telling this woman of the issue of blood that it was just by chance. It was the medicine that the physician gave her last that year. That. She will slap the person and say, look, I know what I'm talking you have your testimony also in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So get yourself ready very well. We want to pray one of those prayers. And the prayer is this. I remember that day, but we are not outside here. I was outside. But I, I raised up my hands like this. Raise up your hands and pray this prayer. And the prayer is this. Say, anything the devil has sown in my body. Anything the devil has sown in my body. I command it to Come out by fire! In the name of 
Lord Jesus, what has you opened your mouth and prayed that prayer? Every thing the devil has sown, every seed of infirmity, every seed of sickness, every seed and loss of darkness, devil has sown in your body. I command it to come out in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Lay that hand on your head now. Thank you, Father. And you are going to pray this prayer. Thank you, Father. Say, deposit of devil in my body. What are you waiting for? Come out in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Oh, yes. Aha. That sickness is not your portion. That sickness is not your portion. That problem is not your load. Send it back to the sender. Command it, command it, command it, command it. In the mighty name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Put down your hands. Few more prayers. Then I will leave. Because if I should stay here, we will continue to pray and we will continue to pray. We will pray this prayer. Anything the devil has done, it's not prayer, I just want to explain something. Anything the devil has done in your life, whether blocking your way from moving forward, anything that is the work of darkness, the very day you pray and receive your deliverance, it backfires. It backfires because it must go somewhere. The devil cannot create anything. It's not a creator. That thing must go back somewhere where it came from. You must understand that very well. There was someone that, that went to use somebody to do juju, use somebody's uh, uh, public air to go and do juju somewhere. The person too was taking all these excuses that life was, uh, or, or it's not fair to her. Uh, the person that they used her body to do juju, to do witchcraft. I've forgotten that that's who here they don't know what is juju. Amen. <laughs> to do witchcraft. And the woman was saying, "Is well, his life is not fair. They said, look, go and pray. Go and pray. When she prayed, and what they had done on her backfired, the person that did it on her received the, the same attack against her. Amen. And she was free. Amen. Will you want to pray that kind of prayer right now? Yes, prayer that would, that, that would backfire on your enemies. You see, our Father and the Lord is here now. You know, as if I was in the spirit, I said I have a few more minutes to, to, to go, and I indeed I'm in the spirit. Because I know it's my time, about time to leave this place. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As if I have seen him coming. <laughs> Three more prayers, and I will take my leave. Let's pray this prayer. Say, every evil arrow, every evil arrow fired against me. Fire when I was sleeping, backfire in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and be pray. Many of the problems you are going through come into your life in the day and in the night. The Bible says pestilence that waste in the new day, attacks of darkness. Command it to backfire, beloved. Yes, you can do better. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Aha, 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 aha. Command it to backfire. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. They are backfired in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Two more prayers. Say, ancient gate of darkness. Gate of darkness. Surrounding, my Surrounding my destiny. What are you still waiting for? Start up by fire in the name of Jesus. Open your hand and pray. That is the death that will not allow you to move forward. That is the gate that will make you to lose out in regular opportunities. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. And the final prayer is this. You see, in this land, this land is flowing with milk and honey. And UK, many people are from UK, from US. Your own place too is flowing with milk and honey. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah to that. Hallelujah. But you need divine anointing to receive those things in that land otherwise the devil is like this you need special anointing and you will get it here before you live in the mighty name of jesus christ 
I say you will get it here before you leave in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You want to pray for that anointing right now. Say the power and the anointing. The power and the anointing. That succeed in every good work. Can you shout that prayer now? Come upon my life. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and be the prayer. The anointing and the power that succeed in every good work. Come upon me now. Come upon me now. Come upon me now. Come upon me now. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus. Mighty name we pray. Put your hands together for the Lord. Amen. See, many of us are not praying again. Our Father and the Lord, you are looking at. Amen. Amen. You are looking at Jesus in his life. Amen. God will use him for us today in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And throughout the days, you will be staying here in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God has sent him to come and bless us. So we are fortunate to be here. And your own miracle will not pass you by in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Before we have our seat, I want to welcome him. Amen. I want to humbly welcome our Father and the Lord all the way from Nigeria. That God will be looking for us. The Lord bless you, child. Uh, prophet, the man of God, God has been using for us, and will still be using for us. Prophet, Olu Allah. God bless you, child. Amen. 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 Where is my half interpreter? <laughs> Our full one? Or to the full? Okay, full interpreter. Where is your wife? She's with the children department, sir. Oh, okay. Amen. Amen. Let's have our seats. Ejekera Joko. Shadu Moke Obaro. First of all, I want to give the Lord of Lord. Tio Fuani Ole Ope. Give us the grace. Lati Wanibi. To be here today. Neo Nee. Today. Built a Jekwe in Shofeko Shishi. Even though the devil does not want it to work. But Oje and Fanin Lafua. But it's a big opportunity unto us. Me and our assistant pastor, sorry, can you Me and our assistant pastor, the person of the dignity, were discussing something in the car. Morning, shall only let the team of ten day to program. I said the nations that we shall bring to, there are so many. Say your man, sorry, on your back, we can your lordship program in church. We are talking about one going for a missionary work in church. Me alone, you both across different nations abroad. Finland, the entire. He said the people in Finland they've tried. So to my sister, wow, Lua. It shows that you are really looking up to God. So, but they won't find like you know for you. Talk to yourself. So, Emma, be no prayer. Apology that we came late. Come and lay down. It's for the goodness of the Lord. Do pray for the Lord and I shall long. I thank God for the servant of the Lord. Alright, wow. Our bro, our friend, our Baba, our daddy, Pastor Tunde Dumoye. Ever me pate wa si ke se na yo. One, one fair wa kupo. He love us so much. Olu wa de ba wa fair wa dada. God will love you too. Ever me celebrate wa belu ate wa dada. Ah, kupo wa ti wa plan the program we. All the people that. Ti me ba ba do a kan kan dilo ni mo ti fulfill o. He said if he does not add any prayer today, he has fulfilled everything. I've been here already. He said he has been here already and he has done all the prayer here. No, no, no. But you want to be telling me to bear any It's the same thing, no, Monson. I must saw the same thing. Must saw the same thing. He has come here to pray. What do you call my Gina Sibai? Answer on Bobo Ghana, and he says, 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 he he said he has been here already today and he has prayed for them for long to down and draw. And I know God has answered the prayer already. So, Simba Dupelo wa ilo ni ojubelo. If I appreciate you today, it's more than that. Go 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 into plan the program with to she she. For those of you that God have used to plan the event to make the success, I appreciate you so much and God bless you. Our assistant pastor, our assistant Bukola, Evan Patewo Sike Sumaye. We appreciate the glory of God in our life. Or to the drive most of the car, or the driver, or it's also the driver, only the assistant landlady, and most of the landlady, which is why that he has two landlady. 
She is the, the assistant. She is also the landlady in terms of the driver and like the landlady one. one and landlady two. Like, he has two landladies. So one try gone here. They've tried so the much. Took part the one situation right here. That for Jesus is the man. They're not the most first landlady one. Also, I greet the first landlady. I want to draw to her. That she stood by us at the one but that one go go and all our brothers at the bed and my wonderful choir and the choirs ever me part of what you see my brother. I appreciate the glory of God. Hey, you be no sin like a thing of fashion. I ye ni ni be. Don't be offended with what I want to do, but this is your place. Hey, my baby, for any tour, you know why you think about that? Why you come over here, come I want I get to me by Allah in the end end long. Tomorrow you are going to see the shilalen. But what you want to do today, please come here. So to bad be on la. Tomorrow you will see me. Tomorrow you go back there to the corner, gun be here, dada. I I believe you have sung so much there. Praise God. Hallelujah. You are not calling me when it's in your long. I'm not going to sing anymore because you have already prayed. So God. Mark us on the Lord Jesus, la la la, in fifteen minutes. I'm going to talk about Jesus within fifteen minutes. In to to bad do la mama so la when she yano. Tomorrow I'll be talking about the miracles because life is where my little Jesus is. Without you knowing who Jesus was, there is no miracle. So I take a lot of or Lord. Let's go into the world. So or up for trekking so Lordier. There's a lot I need to say about it, but my answer there. But I'm going to say a few. Jesus Onisha Yanola. Jesus the mighty miracle worker. Miracle worker, the come up, we want to feel mighty. So you are right, mighty. Oh, you bore now, my show for your correct or for your correct you or I'm off of Macon. Only share Yano, the miracle worker. Now, the Abawa person or Lori only share Yano. You want to talk about the miracle worker? Loni, I want to share Kawati. I want you to pay Yano, but to get with magic. Today there are some work of miracle that people felt they are miracle, but they are just magic. So I want to buy me a buy magic wabi. I didn't come here with a tomorrow. I don't want to share yano, but I want to talk about what is called miracle. But get to learn yano before you can see a miracle. So the original, the real miracle, or your only shepherd with Jesus. It has to do with Jesus. Now, a good of Oko Meniti Jesus she. First, you need to know who Jesus is. Now, a get in Lobai. Let me go to you. Man, so I give you no baby deal. I'm going to talk deep in the scripture. Tabi Jesus, who is Jesus? Near the Hebrew, in the in the tongue of Hebrew, Hebrew, Hebrew. Near the Hebrew. In Hebrew, ah, uh, Jesus to us is Yeshua. Jesus, the word Yeshua means Jesus. Uh -huh. That is what it now, means. Now, the one Yeshua in near the Hebrew, to one soy. What is this Yeshua in the in Hebrew that they are saying? To my pata pata ni olu bala araye. The meaning is the savior of the world. Olu bala araye ni Jesus ti to my to the Yeshua. He is the savior of the world, which the meaning is from the word of Hebrew that means Yeshua. Now, Shempe, I'm as of a Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. You know, we have to say Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Because there are a lot of people that bear that name Jesus. But on to Jackie Jesus, you are yet on a Christ, no one What makes our own Jesus to be different is because of the Christ that has the Jesus Christ. That is to say, Jesus Christ. So, Christ here now. The Christ to us see Messiah. It means Messiah. Near the Hebrew in Hebrew, so Messiah. Lo to us it means Messiah. So Messiah here is to my ni eni amiro. What Messiah means in Hebrew is the person of anointing. So eni amiro unto to us ni the person of anointing. Now, ti iru kai ba ma wa shere ya to ti ke suwa mu asaye because eba lo wa mo bibeli iru Joshua. When you look at Joshua in the Bible, these names are similar and familiar to the name of Jesus. And there are a lot of people in Israel that are called Jesus also. Judas Israel. Up to today, Judas is still in Israel. So when you in Solomon, when you Judas. That is to say, people are still giving the name of their giving Judas as the name of their God. He's carrying out to me away in your demon. This carrot is the name that people are not bearing anymore. So, on Tomuki, Yatova, you know, called Jesus, on Gogani, Christ. 
What makes Jesus' name to be different and unique is the Christ that is attached so, to him. So now, I want him to for a one death. All this, what his name means, who is now the Jesus that we're talking about, the miracle number one. one. The first yes, of the Lord is the Son of God. So, old Tia one in your fair bunny. That is what people do not want to hear. Old Tia show fair bunny. That is what the devil does not want to hear. Yes, we get on more long. That for you to say to him that Jesus is the Son of God. He doesn't want you to say anything about it. So, old one, Papa, the first day, the more left on you. That is the first thing I'm bringing about about Jesus unto us. Only on more long, the Son of God. On more long, let me be one come on him. I brought the Son of God to visit you today. That can do the work of miracles. All these other names cannot do any miracles. I said it sometimes in the way. You can easily say the God of Apostle Babalola. The God of Olu Allah. The God of our Adeboye. The God of Adeboye. Let me guess on it. Guess on. Oh Lord, we guess on. But it is impossible to say Jesus, the God of Jesus. The Yatokawa, we need to guess on. There is a different between Jesus. Because it's a God in human. Oh, the Lord, that was a boy. Oh Lord, we Adeboye. Oh Lord, Babalola. Oh Lord, Olu Allah. If we begin to mention all the name of all these prophets and pastors, pass. Oh Lord, we need to open one. They are referring to the God that has called them. Jesus, they are repent. But Jesus is not. It's not like that. We cannot reference to him that it was somebody that called him. Oh, good in what kind? It pleases him in his own heart. His bow go as he lets him to drop his glory in heaven. Let you what sin was here and to come to the head. So let you what be a million. And he came to the head like in front of the man. Then we know when you do see we we hear what he gives to us. Even though the heart of man were not pleased for this. Now yes, we are not that one sorrowy part. The Jesus that we are talking about. Oh my, come on to back and the mood you don't need be all dear on all love. The first thing I want you to know very importantly is that he is the Son of God. I'm reading and in Luke chapter one. You can find that in the book of Luke chapter one. Chapter one verse thirty five. Go. The book of chapter one, verse thirty-five. Should have known my rules and regulation that we have to read the Bible. Mama, so run it by Bible for you. Dem at the I will be talking about the Bible, and I want you to follow me. So, Luke chapter one, verse thirty-five. The book of Luke chapter one, verse thirty-five. Eja kagbo kati or along some way. Let's hear what God has said there. Look, you can read it all. If you are here quickly, you can read. And the angel answered. Yes. Mm. The Holy Ghost shall come upon thee, mm. and the power of the Ayah shall overshadow thee. Yes. Therefore also, the only things which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. And she gets to the ones of the people and by the Jesus they are talking about. And it's the only, the only or more long. We call him the Son of God. Or more long, we need to be man new. In holiness, need in kamima kama tiara le daddy. That something of holy will come out of you. That will be called the Son of God. So ikeji, the second year sunje ulubala is the deliverer. Um ta ibiganta logani. That is where we are going. Jesus, Jesus, that we are talking about the miracle worker is your deliverer. Only ulubala, you know. He's also our savior. Mama, me kodi edie. Wani bo wani bo lo kuni shero juwe. Mama, me kodi edie. Wani bo lo kuni shero juwe. Mama, me kodi edie. Wani bo lo kuni shero juwe. Mama, me kodi edie. Wani bo lo kuni shero juwe. Mama, me kodi edie. Wani bo lo kuni Titi da afi kwa na bene kwa ni pa kwa mene O Lugbala The Savior Matthew chapter 1 Verse 21 Matthew chapter 1 Verse 21 The book of Matthew chapter 1 verse 21 And she shall bring forth a son hmm. And thou shalt call his name Jesus Yes For he shall save his people from their sins Oti to cherry life. He balani be komu awo inya kuro di mu eche mo. The yamu to la baladu la ye niki Jesus boga hela. Salvation, the most supernatural salvation is for Jesus to save you. Be on the like that when kati o polo polo wa kiri lo ni i yamu niko. Even though what people are looking forward to today is just miracle. Na ni tori balala o kaya mo. They don't care anymore because of that. They don't care about their salvation anymore. Even pastors are not. They are not conscious of their own salvation of their heart or soul. They are not conscious of the salvation of their soul anymore. 
All their concern and anxious of is how to be rich and be wealthy. And today I was praying. And somebody sent a link to me. And they send the link of this man to me to be able to read the story quickly. BBC. Yoruba BBC. The television program and they showed the house of this man. It does not have a good house. It does not have a single good house. He lives in the house that you have to buy. And this man, Nigerians, the country, they left him alone. They could not even look at what he has been to the country. Oh, that he has has been to the country. country. It means that those that don't know Jesus very well, they are pursuing and running after something that will not die. The ways of world always die. Money ends and finish. Beauty. Beauty ends. This is not how I look at when I was dating. I was a doctor, 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 you see very clearly that it's not the way you are when you are in your youth age. So, you are the beauty of the beauty of the beauty of the no matter how beautiful you are, when you are youth, it, it will go to fade away. My last lady, me, in the world, I'm 25. My last lady, when she was 25, please, can we guess how she will look like? Let me know. Please, now. Nice. Look at how she is. I'm not saying she's not beautiful for the jungle. Maybe you might be looking for my mistake. I'm not saying she's not beautiful. At the age of, for your teenager, I be able to ask her because that's your age or your youth age. I age. Every pay bell for our sherry. You see that you are not going to be in that state forever. So if Balalu ya can make it, it's salvation that we should pursue. And but what we are running after today matter. is that which will finish and hang. Oh, money, ipo, position, ah, the way Balalu document, only she, only she, and so well, not that can you. All these things are good things that we need to do. But the most treacherous thing is to do. And you have everlasting joy. You don't need that now, can you? In salvation of your soul. That is the reason why he came to the earth. 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 Who is Jesus in your life? Yeah, like you respond that way in your kind of one. I know some of the response that is here. Oh, Jehu, look that lami. One side is a oh, the only share of my soul. Oh, Jehu, it means a lot to them. Oh, Lord, she saw Jimmy become. I went for your revival. The come for my time. Mama, yeah, he wrote it too. Nigga, deliverance. He look at him, mommy, pastor. She, mama, do boy. Nigga, come calling. Only I want only open it to let let can. When we are having the prayer, we are praying prayer. Mama, I want the garment got loose. And I called attention. This is you think that you are coming here just like that? Mama, mama, twice she didn't hear from me. I said God purposely exposed your spirit to me. Pastor, but you, you are using the pastor to provide you. But you are walking with the devil. But you are walking with the devil. And you are walking with the devil. Look at all these wicked people. What did I put on my head? I put back on my head. I put back on my head. Because I have this band, this if you know that I'm, I'm with that person, you don't look at it now. You look at it now. And you are afraid to push that light or the Bible away. Because you don't want to offend God. 
Because you will charge you will reduce the whole of the world. Even though the government of God is because of people who are not paid. Or if you pay the baby daddy, can you pay she? You deceive me. If somebody of another religion talks, so that you don't want to offend me, or you pay she, you deceive Kura. Even with the Kura, you don't want to offend the person with the Kura. So after my dog was sick, they will begin to package and adjust it. So and no mirror, no nanny, the law cow. So people are not even careful of what they are saying. Oh no, tomato. If what they are pursuing and running after is that which you are doing, and then it stopped miracle. Now they are beginning to say for miracle. The last revival we had was in the temple of London. A lady brought all her documents. And he said, Prophet, don't you want London? Since I've been in London, London they are lying. I've just been there like someone that is in emptiness. Money on Tonica, young Bowie. She may be told that one. Do I pay for no pay in my year? Then the difference if you pass all the year. What about the person that has her pay? Where does it stay? Who did the power? She will leave. What is your faith? Who was your prophet or your pastor? You need that body in the world. She may not share me in Dallas. Some of you have faith in prophet and pastor, but you are not person of salvation. One last ship, one in one year, one lonely. And that is why we have a lot of problems in our life today. One of you was your blessing. And they put us under the, under the canopy of religion. Or doctrine. Or doctrine. Doctrine collect by Leshela. Doctrine cannot save a sinner. Or collect by Allah. Or can the Papa day walk through her life. What can save you is your encounter with Jesus. So God is your home of your life. God is your home of your life. I want me to accept that it is a miracle worker. Oh my show, it will be difficult. Those who don't understand what we are doing, we know our judges. God answer prayers in subjection. Don't go to the Adura worship for two. But it's not up to how we are praying. The fact is, Mama Power can answer some testimony. K K K D D N. I know some people that have given some testimony here, but share my weekly Google one. I put your testimony down so. Do you know that we are more than the testimony we have been sharing? I will fast. Then if I get carried away, me alone, my man, take me there. That is the fast. I want you, the brethren, to begin to hold on. If they want one, only see you know what. Our boys are so much and loud to God. Super, Ori, Yanubi, be washito. But we are not seeing miracle the way our boys and our echo are so loud. Can you get too far? What is the cause of this? It is because our heart is far away from God. Our mind is not faithful well to God anymore. We have not met with the Savior anymore. There is no kind of miracle I have not seen. When I was living here, I saw the testimony of Doctor Jeremy be sharing for me. And he told me the testimony about what happened at your workplace. Hey, that man, can you call me up? For those of you that does not know a lot, Moade, she has sat down me, and I got to Amsterdam. Much I want to lunch, baking, cause she has me there. Okay, tomorrow I was going to relax to have a lunch. Yeah, but in Bahwe, you're making call. You're doing program. I was trying to make call. What's that? The program. I'm doing what you want. Me, you're doing. I never heard that they started boarding. Because you're doing. 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 Because we have let it late. Run down to your bed before you miss your flight. One A, and I got to one A. Body by my collar, baby. And I saw a man beside me. I never know who Nigeria is. I never know who one of the rich people in Nigeria. You know the rich people that don't want the poor to sit beside them. Good afternoon, sir. And I greeted him. Come on, girl, bring me girl. I think I'm a king. I never knew that I don't like to greet. And I'm a king. 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 I'm and he look at me with that look of sadness. I know that he put out in his mind. Okay, can you read the very dark concept where we are from? How come this kind of person wants to sit beside me? No, I don't want to bother you, Bonio. I don't understand. 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 When I was born, the Iran team by Abiru Badai. A white person like that. Oh yeah, people were sitting there. And they stood up from where they were sitting. Oh, you could not go in wow. And I was still on my knee. Hello. And he stopped me. Hello. How are you? How are you? Please. And he said, please. He said he was directed that I should sow seed. And I should sow a seed to your life. To your life. Wow. Oh God, you're so kind. And I wish you all the best. This is not a dream in the life. And the man that I said is the reason I was with you. I greeted to him. He didn't answer me. Hey, 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 hey! I need to make a plain sound. I don't know you. 
You can't know me. I said I greet you two times. You refuse to answer me. And I responded, I greeted you two times and you never answered. Now you are now said you you want to know me. I don't no, say you want know. to know me. Oh, Is it it possible? Ah, you. Emi, Nigeria. Oh, give me, me or that Arabic in terms of me. Yeah, I the brain we are talking about the same complexion. He greeted, he did not answer, but the one in person stood school. up and came to bless him. The time when your hope has lost. The real miracle is the time when hope has lost. When the people do not see anything, and, away, you you are 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 and the people have rejected him, so I want to be alone. And Jesus will come as God, and he will manifest I as God, and he will do as he could. That is what makes you to be honorable and honorable to be in your life. And you so will be a different person. Please, 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 and please, 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 I need your contact because I need to know you. I there was the president in Nigeria. And I said, you are the president of Nigeria. That will not give you my contact. If you can't pay number, you can't pay. Say what you want. And I will answer. It is you that will give you my number too. That is a miracle. 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 That is